they're confident enough to come to us because they know this is a safe place for them and they will be not judged and they will get some support or other that they require. But we're still having huge challenges with police. Women come to us when police, a lot of women come to us when police don't listen, don't treat domestic violence seriously. We have got pending rape cases and also we have got uh, a new trend is the uh, uh, technology facilitated violence, that's online violence and bullying and so on. We're seeing that also. So having a little, a lot of difficulty in law enforcement and it doesn't seem to go away. Uh, you know, and we are trying to talk to police. We are trying to uh, offer our services for training because we are the best in this area, uh, recognized nationally and regionally, and we are offering, but no one seems to be listening. Uh, we have got some good officers that have been trained, that are doing good work, but on the whole, I would say our biggest challenge is uh, the, the law enforcement agency. You talked about training. I mean, have you done any training the previous years or this year with police? Look, we had a very good thing going prior to 2006. We had we have been always training police at the academy and at different you know at different levels, the qualifying levels, and so on. But all that stopped. But we have done in person, but not regularly. And this year we have done only one, and that is through the office of the UN Human Rights Commissioner. So and and not like being called on our own to be able to do that. And that's about two hours, that's not enough. Because if you look at assault cases, the highest assaults are on women by men. So, you know, so they really need to, and, and, and the gender sensitizing, they really are very, um, the attitude is very sexist, misogynistic, and uh, discriminatory, you know, whatever, you know, like how women are to be treated in our society, you know, that whole gendered, uh, look that they give to it. So because of that, the, the attitude, they are not able to help women because women should not be reporting. So that has been ongoing. Uh, that has been always there. But there have been improvements in the middle. When they don't get the training, the, the appropriate training, uh, effective training, then this is where we end up. We are, we've been complaining about police for the last 40 years. So 